Donna and Greg had their few off off cuts of the sofa if they had that covered and uh, managed to sort it out into a dress. I don't know. Hand out three four. Yeah, very good. That's a good rally from Lovent. Yeah, nicely done. Good attack in. Simple drop 11, shot. Nice five, compact swing there Lovin. from Lovent on the drop. One game to love. Quick fire stuff between these two. Well, to get within a point here. She just has to really make sure that she attacks oh. severely like that when the opening is there. Because that way she can actually sort of unsettle Lobin and but again Lobin able to stretch and that down. court out. Six, eight. That's a lovely serve. Out. Oh, oh. She's Hit the camera. 11, yeah. nine. She's hit the, the road rain. camera. She's having a look up there, ball. protruding out. Blame it on Squash TV. <laughs> well, again, Ibrahim coming back strongly after a really positive Three, start four. from Lobham. Well, Lobham doing well to re establish this lead. Yeah, this is crucial. This third game, we hit the business end now. It's a lovely shot. It's a quality shot. Very deceptive. Nine five. High end. Post from the back of the court. Three game balls for a two one lead. Another lovely lob serve. Not making. That's uh, a good play. A nice Eleven, bit of deception. Seven game to Lobben. I think she's a good front runner, Ibrahim. This is where she applies most of her pressure. So she hasn't really started the game off well at all, where she's built a lead right from the start. So it's going to be interesting to see how she pushes on now that she's two love up in this third game, fourth game even. She's going to have to go and regroup, see if she can find those back corners again. And out, 3-9. I, I, but just a little bit, you know, I don't want to take anything away from Ibrahim, but I just, I think Nick, Ma well, Nick Matthew will be furious with just the, the drop in focus after that. Down. And there the error. I mean, now we're back in a situation five, where Ibrahim, within a few minutes, Donald Lobden was 2-1 up. Now she's 2 all, and the momentum's with a very dangerous young Egyptian player. As we said, Ibrahim does struggle technically when you get into the corners, both with the actual um, technique of the shot, but also the movement aspect. Wow, what a one-two that is. It's one of the first times we've seen the cross-court lift from the back of the court and then follows it up with that thunderous. Okay. Nicely done. Yeah, it stemmed from the back court though. The ball was a decent Nine length, eight. forced a loose ball. Oh, would you believe it? I believe it. And there's the kind of Nine. the swing. It was a lovely shot That's from Donna Lobin and the swing, <laughs> managing to get the ball. <laughs> Full swing Nine. with no sidewalk, and she's got it on there. I mean, it's a killer when that happens to you. We've all experienced it, and it is an absolute killer. Especially when it's like 10 9. I mean, that's Match brutal. Ball. I mean, there we go. I mean, it's the old fist pump just at the 50 minute mark, and it's Ibrahim that takes out the Australian number one, Donald Robin, three games to two.
to hit long or short and then to be able to make the late decision to actually choose the correct one. And out. Certainly Three, laid five. that into the net. Last couple of games. Ten three. Well, Julian Cortese with seven game balls. He's very happy to take a comfortable first game. Again, there's the example. Nice technique. Eleven three. Good game skill Cortese. set and Cortese looking smooth, untroubled. Oh, what a shot. Oh, it's beautiful. Talking about feathering it over the tin. Couldn't have been any softer. Two, one, from Lovely the left, hands. please. It's good hustling. Out. That's very good hustling ah. there from Cortez. Three really good gets under pressure. Six, three. Yeah, it's nicely finished. 11-6. Game Yeah, to good Cortese. power from Cortese. Four. Love. Not up. Again, Game see that two, movement of Potter. Here we go. 11 2, matched Cortes 3 2, two game to love. 11 3, 11 6, 11 2. Sharp from Cortes onto that ball nice and quickly. Julian Cortese bookie a place into round two. The top. Hand out for all. Ten eight game ball. Well, it's been a stroke and a ten from our opponent. It was very good wit. She apologised, but very accurate. Henny, Henny leads so one game the to love. more experienced, you leave the ball in the middle, or you leave the ball sitting up, you're in big, big trouble. I mean, yeah, I mean. It's, I mean, the, 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 the natural power that both the girls generate is, is huge, and that's across the board for a lot of these Five, Egyptian three. players. But it's the adaptability with the technique, which... Well, she sent it the wrong way, and she's back in this. Didn't all... There's a chance. Oh. I mean, Hanny's just held. All. Managed to play a perfect high. And she has done. So Hanny manages to fight to back. Game to Hanny. Hanny leads to game to love. To take the second game and extend her lead now to two games to love. Body language not good here from Shia. 8 2. Nice shot from her. Hand out. 3 8.
Oh, what a finish. Yeah, it's a lovely, lovely finish and a, and a good game there from Hanny. She could have been in a potential rut with Shear, particularly if she had lost that second game, managing to close out the younger Egyptian in three games to book her place into the second round. Twenty-eight minutes, just shy of half an hour. Three love victory for Hanny. It's the lightness of Sobi on her feet. It's unbelievable. She's got such a light step and Nine quick coverage. Almost just glides across left the surface side. when she was actually, ironically, probably close to her opponent's age, playing in qualifying for US Open at Drexel. Yeah. She's probably 14 or 15, and she wouldn't have been any more and than 16. Out. And she's very impressed with her there. She's got a natural plyometric. You talk about in a game like squash. See the way she bounds, like when she's hitting, and she's there's a nice 11 2 game to Sobi. Sobi leads 1 control game power to power. Yeah, this is a nice workout here for Six Sabrina Sobi. It's an interesting one for me. This yeah, you've seen what they've gone on to achieve, and obviously the characters that they are. That you know, I was just wondering. You know, it's from a coach's point of view, it's to assess what that the character of your pupil is like, because I feel it can also work in quite a damaging way. So Sabrina Sobi takes the second game. game. Sobi Sobi leads two games to love. Would you would you look to provide a situation like this? I, I'm talk, I'm not talking about younger. You know I'm, you know she's 15. This this young girl and she's personally I think this is too early for her. Yeah, well, that's what I feel. But I just wanted to see what you felt that. What I'm trying to say is that, you know, it could put a, a younger player off. <laughs> so Sabrina Sobi, obviously, it looks like she's going to come through here. Her next match is going to be against Norel Shabini. <laughs> well, as you, there we go. Chalk and cheese. <laughs> <laughs> the seasoned, battle-hardened veteran that is the grand old age of, what's she now, 25? 25, I reckon, now, yeah. <laughs> 25. She's been through the war, she's still nursing that knee issue, isn't she? Past this Run youngster two, 11, love. comfortably. 11, three. 20 minutes equaling the quickest match of today's play. Three love victory for Sabrina Sobi to book her place in the second round.